This is something that might run through your mind when you swipe your card at an ATM or at the gas pump. You might be wondering if your card could be skimmed in that moment. Reporter Dave Faraday is live for us tonight in Hickory, where someone just used stolen card information at three ATMs to steal thousands of dollars. And Dave, you say the victims at first didn't even know that they had been compromised until their bank accounts sent them alerts. Yeah, Erica, they had no idea. We know from all of these police reports here in Hickory that the thieves went to three different Wells Fargo ATMs north of the downtown area. I did get a chance to talk with several of those victims today. One of them told me that at the time of the theft here in Hickory, his credit card was in his wallet an hour and a half from here. It took the thieves exactly 51 minutes to visit the three Wells Fargo ATM locations in North Hickory to steal just over $3,000. We spoke with several of the victims today by phone. All of them live in the Asheville area and had no idea about the thefts until it was too late. The card was actually in my wallet, so it was not stolen. I have no idea how they would have been able to duplicate my card and create a pin and be able to withdraw cash. Police have assigned two investigators to the case. They are working tonight to get surveillance photos from all three locations where the money was withdrawn. Investigators believe the thief may have made bogus ATM cards by placing a skimmer somewhere near Asheville. The accounts all came back to Telco Credit Union in Buncombe County. We visited the Hickory location today where Tessa Ramsey says she takes precautions. I actually have a daily reminder um, that comes up text message, lets me know kind of what's going on. According to the North Carolina Department of Consumer Standards, 23 skimmers were found on different gas pumps in the first quarter of 2019 statewide. Those numbers are up from just five cases during the same first three months last year. Lewis Walker says he doesn't take any chances with his account and closely guards his personal information. I most definitely do. I check my, my account balances online most of the time, and, and I'm always, you know, worry about, about those type of situations. And we reached out to Telco Credit Union over in Asheville to see if they've had any reports of possible skimmers over there or skimmers on any of their equipment. Tonight, Scott, they are not commenting about this investigation. Back to you.